today I'll be opening the best zoo in all of Roblox. This is a dream come true. Ever since I was a young child, I wanted to open up my very own zoo. So since this is my first zoo, we're gonna need to figure out the basics. Uh, we're gonna need to upgrade our zoo. All right, whoa. Well, that was pretty easy. We just added an entrance. It says, welcome to pet zoo. All right, cool. Uh, we can add a ticket booth for $20. That's nice. All right, so that's where people will come in. You know, they'll kind of look around and then they'll buy tickets. Uh, we can add in decorations. Oh, nice little tree that looks like a lollipop. A pathway where people can walk to different enclosures like this. This will be our first ever enclosure. So every enclosure needs a couple of different things, mainly terrain so that the animals have stuff to walk on. Every animal's terrain is going to be a little bit different. We can also add in a waterfall. So this animal's probably going to like water and uh, maybe in their natural habitat, they have a waterfall that's normally nearby. We can add in some decorations. This looks so cool. Look at that. We got little tiny palm trees with some coconuts. A bridge for our animals. That's actually not a bad idea. And it looks amazing. And the most expensive thing, I guess, is the summer enclosure sign. This is where we'll be able to see all of the pets inside of the enclosure. Right now, it's empty, though, so we need to capture some pets. And then we can activate this area so that all the visitors know that it's ready to be seen. So we have four different places we can go. This is my zoo. We'll call it the cookie zoo. Yo, look at that. People are already starting to show up. I don't, I don't have, have any, any animals, animals, so we're gonna, we're gonna need to get, get animals, animals so they don't, so they don't leave. leave. They already paid for tickets, and there's no refunds. There's no refunds, everybody. You guys have to stay until I find animals. I flipped, dude. I need animals now. Okay, so let's go to the hub. We need to walk through this giant door in order to unlock our first realm. Yeah, we did it. The lock stopped. Awesome. Okay, let's go through. And whoa, there's wild pets inside. Oh, that's so sick. What is this? Oh, it's a leafy pet. What the heck? All right, I want this. It's a wild leafy. I want to capture it. Capture pets by drawing within the lines of the magic ruin. Oh, that's easy enough. Okay, let's uh, select a swirl ruin. So it's, it's like a pokeball, but for the wild animals in this world. All right, so I just need to draw. Make sure we stay in the lines. Yes. There we go. We're going to go around town. We're going to go to the bottom, and then we're going to go this way, and then we're going to go up, and then we're going to complete it. There's a time limit. I hate pressure situations. Ruin score 100%. We got a leafy. Okay, now we need to put it in the enclosure before people start to get really mad and leave my zoo. Come on, Jack. Go, 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 go. Hi, welcome. Come on in. Yes. Yes, we do have animals. Yes, please. Come come on. Right in. Right inside, lady. She has no idea. Okay, so if we go over here, uh, we can interact with this, and I think we could send our first actual animal to our enclosure. You are now ready to run your pet zoo. The more pets you have, the more stars your zoo is star. The more stars you have, the more money you earn. So, okay, more stars equal more cash. I want all the money. Okay, we can also add in some things that'll make our zoo just a little bit nicer. We can add in park benches. Uh, I guess we could add in a lamppost over here. The arrows that are constantly pointing to these things make it feel like I have to do it. And it's probably, like, not the worst idea. It's overall making my park look a lot better, but I don't know. I don't know if I want to spend this kind of money right now. Okay, collect here. Wait, we can, we can collect money? Okay, that's how I collect money from the people that are coming in. We actually just made money by spending money. I guess what they say is true. You gotta spend money to make money. Okay, we'll put in a lamppost and we'll just keep collecting money. So that's all of my ticket sales. And we can start a brand new enclosure. Okay, this one's going to be an island enclosure. We'll add in a decoration on this big rock. A little palm tree with some coconuts. Another palm tree with some coconuts. And another palm tree with a giant rock and the same size coconuts. What about uh, over here? Oh, a sunken ship. That's a good idea. And an ocean. I have enough money for crates too. And then we can add in the pirate enclosure sign. This one is my new favorite. The other one was pretty cool, but this one's awesome. And because we just opened up the pirate enclosure, we have access to a new realm. Also, guys, I need your help. If you want this to be a series on the channel, it'll be powered by your guys' likes. So leave lots of likes on today's video, and I'll keep making my zoo bigger and better. Also, leave some name suggestions down below for our animals. This one, it, it's called a leafy. That's kind of like its normal name, like a cat or a dog. But we need some good names for leafy. I want to give a really cool nickname to every single animal that I get. Okay, before I go start spending more money, let's go back to the hub. Later in the video, we can check out Morpheus the Pet Morpher. That'll allow us to turn into some of the pets that we have inside of our zoo. I found another swirl ruin. Okay, cool. So we can grab them. They'll just kind of pop up everywhere that we go. Grab another one of those. And then we could use it to catch even more of these pets. I keep wanting to say Pokemon, but they're not Pokemon. They're just like normal pets. Okay, let's capture this. Swirl. We'll drag it very, very nicely. Very, yes, yes, there, yes, slow. Daddy, I maybe missed a part at the start. That's fine. It's okay. We're just going to color it in. My time's running out. Okay, we'll get it up here. Color it in. Ruin score 100%. We're killing it. Oh, my zoo is about to be the best zoo in all of Roblox history. Okay, for our new pirate enclosure, we need something that actually lives near an ocean and also on the sand. So let's head over to the next realm. The Sandy Shore. Whoa, level three. Okay, so the more stars that they have, I'm pretty sure that will increase the quality of my zoo and more people will want to come to it and I'll make more cash money. Okay, wait a second. That one's only a level one star. So let's go, wait, a level four star? Hold up, how do I get that one? There's different rarities. 
parties. Okay, this has just completely changed the entire game. How do I get this one? Can I capture it? Wait, can I just use a normal swirl on it? No way. Okay, the time limit's probably gonna be pretty quick. 10 seconds on the clock. My dude is in the way. Look at that. On the right side of the screen, it's, it, my character is blocking me, but that that's okay. That's okay. We're gonna do this. Okay, we need to color it in fully. Yeah, my face! 100%! Yes! We did it! Okay, so it looks like for higher starred pets, our chances go down quite a bit. It said that our chance for that was only 50%. But because you guys are smashing like on today's video, we got it anyway. What about a Waffy? What's up, Waffy? I want another Waffy. 100%? Please tell me I got it! Try a stronger ruin next time. Oh, we didn't get it! It escaped! So you can buy better ruins in order to have your chances of catching the pet go up. Hmm, what should I do? Uh, I think I'm gonna have to go for a legendary ruin pack. It's a thousand Robux, guys. All right, we gotta do it. I'm doing it. I did it. I can't let any of the pets get away in today's video. Hmm, yes, we have lots of new ruins to test out. Let's use the Nova Ruin. Okay, wait, this one's like a completely different style. So we're gonna make sure that we get this right. Here we go. We're gonna scribble in the middle. We go this way, this way, up here. That has to be enough, right? Did, did, did I get it? It looks pretty colored into me. 98%. All right, not 100%, but I will take it. Kind of a little bit mad that I did not get 100% there. I'm not gonna lie. We're not gonna beat ourselves up over it because we caught the Waffy. We actually did it. Oh, level three Waffy. Okay, okay, capture. Oh, uh, let's use our dusk ruin on this bad boy. Okay, how does this one work? Uh, let's start it from the middle. We're gonna just like scribble, 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 go up. Did I get it? 100%. Oh, we're getting good at this. And we caught it. Okay, let's head back to my zoo and then we can create a brand new enclosure. Oh, nice. We just got another $3,000. We're raking in some money. Okay, let's uh, interact with this and we can put in our different waffies. We have a level four, a level three, and a level two. They're all inside and they love it. Look at that. They have hearts everywhere. And because this is now an 18 star enclosure, people will be willing to pay more to get into my zoo. Like, look at that. We already collected another thousand dollars and that was like 10 seconds. Thank you for your contribution to the cookie zoo. Hey, where, hey, where are you guys going? Where you got, yo, go back in the zoo. Actually, wait, go back out and then come back in and then buy more tickets. Make sure you guys are leaving comments down below of some nicknames for the different animals that I'm adding to my zoo. Okay, we have two more leafies that we can put in there. Actually, wait, it's just the one. The other one was already inside. All right, cool, look at that. Now I have a friend. There's still so many more enclosures that I can add. Go add in a park bench. We'll add in a volcano. Another the park bench. The volcano exhibit is going to be one of the coolest ones yet. We added in, okay, we added in a full volcano in the span of three seconds. We'll add in some hot dogs. Eventually, we'll need to add in a cookie stand. I can actually climb to the top of the volcano. This gives me a great view of my entire zoo so far. Since we have the money, let's add another volcano enclosure. We'll add in some rocks, some more rocks there. I don't think I have enough money for this. But my zoo collected $12,000 already. And it's due to my waffies, bro. Everybody loves looking at the waffies. This dude's running to go see the waffies. He's probably running to the ATM to get more money to buy even more tickets. Okay, so let's go add in some more rocks, some burnt trees, and also ruins for our animals. Kind of seems a little bit bad that, like, the wall is not very high in this exhibit. So we should probably not put anything that's super super hostile inside or else it's gonna break out. But this is looking awesome so far. Look at this exhibit. This one's probably the best one yet. And then we can put the volcano enclosure sign. Let's see, in this enclosure, the gar has double stars. Okay, so if we put a certain pet inside of their preferred exhibit, they'll actually get more stars and we'll make more money. I get that I'm in the pet business, but like I'm kind of also in the money making business now so that I can buy more things and get even more exotic pets. Uh, inaugurate this area for brand new people. Awesome. Okay, cool. People are able to come over here now. Welcome, everybody. We'll give them a little bench and a nice little lollipop tree to look at. And now we need to go hunting for some gar. There's also a pet upgrader. This man looks very wise. Hello, wise sir. Yes, I would like to upgrade one of my pets. Am I able to upgrade my level four Waffy? Wait, can I upgrade multiple? Can I upgrade all of them? Oh, wait a second. Actually, there I can combine pets together. Okay, so let's try to combine our two leafies together. What does that do? Oh, okay. So it looks like there's a bar. And then I guess if I get them up enough, it'll push them up to the next star. So yeah, we're going to need to catch some more leafies. There is a level four star leafy. Yes, yes. Okay, let's try to use our, our Nova. There we go. This will give us a 75% chance to catch this. Yes, very slow, very steady. We're gonna do a little circle, 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 circle. 100%. Okay, we got it. Pet captured. We had a 75% chance that we actually got it. Oh my gosh, we're gonna have the best zoo. I'm so excited. Okay, let's get another leafy. These guys, I'm not really worried. Even if we have a 80% chance, like that's good enough. Oh, uh, you want to join my zoo? Yes, you do. Yes, you do. There we go. Did we get it? Please tell me this is it. I think we might have gotten it. 100%. And we captured another leafy. We're on a roll. Another level four. Hold on. Wait a second. Our leafy exhibit 
it's about to be the best one yet. Okay, let's um use our Dusk Ruin so that we at least have a like a fighting chance of getting this thing. Okay, honestly, you could just like scribble and you don't even have to get it into lines. All you gotta do is just light up everything. I think we got it. 99%. Did I get it? Yes! We captured another level four leafy. Our next stop is Magma Volcano. This place looks awesome. We'll unlock that and uh, I guess we should just head right through. At the center, there is a huge volcano that is active, which does not seem super safe for the pets. Wait, they have different types of leafies down here. Look at these. These are orange. They're like different textured. And then there's also the gar. Let's see how difficult it is to catch one of these. Oh, it's actually not that bad. They're basically little tiny dragon pets that we can add to our cookie zoo. And if you guys know me, you know that I need to have at least one dragon inside of my zoo. Oh, let's go. We got one. Okay, now it's time to get a lot more. Wait, there's different colored ones down here. Oh my gosh, wait, there's a level four, like super shiny looking leafy. We're gonna use our Dusk Ruin. I know I don't have uh, too many more of these left, but it is going to be worth it. People are gonna pay big bucks to come see this thing. Come on, I think we got it. Oh yeah, let's go. This gar looks extra spicy. Come on, 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 come on. Booyah, baby! We got it! So I've been catching some of the gar for a little bit, and it looks like I caught them all. I don't see any others. So let's go ahead back to my zoo, and then I'll show you guys every single one of the pets that I just got after we check our money. We are rolling in $74,000 inside of my ATM. Don't mind if I collect that. Okay, we're gonna interact, or interact with this, and um, I'm pretty sure I can put some more in there. Actually, I don't think I caught any more waffies. So let's go over to my leafy section and uh, we'll add a couple more over here. Leafy, leafy, leafy. We'll send this guy. We'll send this one. Wait, the enclosure gets full. Okay, so you can only have so many inside. So we'll need to optimize it and take out all of the level one star. And then we need to make sure to have all of the level four stars in there for now until we can combine our other leafies together. We could also make our next enclosure an oasis. Wait, this is starting to get kind of expensive. I guess all the sand and all the rock and a waterfall is starting to add up in price. $1,800 for a, a one cactus? Two. Two, two cacti. What about an obelisk? Yeah, the obelisk is cool. It's probably made out of some nice granite. A beautiful palm tree with some nice coconuts. Decorations, some tikis, also some grass in the desert. There was barely any grass. I just paid $2,000 and I got, I got this. I got weeds. I did not realize it was so expensive. But we did just make a brand new uh, enclosure and we have access to a brand new realm that will have a, a kaku. I think that's a cactus. It looks so cute though. Look at its eyes. Look at its mouth. It has like little tiny cactus arms and it has like spikes on it, but they do not look spiky at all. Let's go get one. First things first though, let's go add in all of the gar that we got. I was only able to find one star gar and I caught them all. So I don't know like where the rest of them are hiding that are higher starred, but we'll have to figure it out later. They easily have the best enclosure in the entire cookie zoo though. Look at that. They got ruins. They got torches. They got like different areas to jump up to. What's going on up here? Oh, we can finally add in lava. Whoa. Okay, I, I just stood inside of the lava. I don't know if that was good. What is this? Okay, we can open up this next section. All right, cool. Visitors know to go there now. In that short amount of time, we made $37,000. Our zoo is slowly yet surely evolving into one of the best zoos ever. Let's just keep upgrading our zoo. We have $92,000 to spare. Tree garden? Why not, right? A lamppost? Sure. Yeah, that, that, that'll be nice for nighttime. Uh, another lamppost. Lamppost for you? What's up, Waffies? All right, we're gonna come over to this side and add in a uh, tree garden, park bench, a lamppost, power plant. What? Oh, we're adding in another enclosure. A mountain. That dude, what kind of mountain is that? It's so tiny, bro. That's, that's, not, that's like not even close to being a mountain. All right, what's the terrain? There was grass. There was there was already grass there. I just spent so much money on that. What about decorations? That is cool. That is more of a mountain than this thing. Next up, we can add gears. All right, that's, yeah, that's, I understand that. Uh, $5,000 for that. Energy road. That was worth every single penny. What about this? Uh, engine enclosure sign. Oh, nice. And now we can unlock another pet, the L Buddy. The L, -L Buddy? It honestly looks like a Pachirisu Pokemon. It's so cute, bro. I love it. All right, cool. And now we can open up this section for new people. We still have more money to spend, which is kind of crazy. I just spent $16,000 on pine trees. Whoever my accountant is for this zoo is not going to be very happy with my financial decisions. But I bet you we have tons more money to show for it. You see, we're spending money, but we're also making so much money. Look at that, another $37,000 in the bank. And we have two new pets.
pets that we can go find. How much money do I make? I make $1,000 every like 10 seconds. Ah, uh, hi, Morpheus. Uh, we need to unlock one more enclosure to be able to morph into pets. I'll be back, Morpheus. So we unlocked a realm way over there, but there's also the Aether Islands that are a lot closer. So I am lazy and do not like walking. We're gonna head through this gate. Whoa, wait a second. Okay, so we can use a tornado to get all the way up to the top. That's actually awesome. Let's ride out. Whoa, okay, that was sick. And now we're up here with the Ella Buddies. Ella Buddy, I would like to capture you, please. Uh, let's use our upper ruin so that we don't lose out on this, really. I did this right next to a tree, but I'm still gonna nail it. Oh, look at that. We didn't even miss one single spot. 100% booyah, let's go. Wait, what are these things over here? Can I capture them? A Houndron. Whoa, there's a level three. This thing looks so awesome. I want it. It looks so cool. I need it in my zoo now. Okay, we're gonna use our Nova Ruin in order to make sure that we get this thing. Okay, let's do this. We'll go to the middle, draw a lot in the center. Honestly, like, it looks good. And it thought so too. There's a level two. Okay, we'll capture this uh, with the upper ruin. What? No, there was a 61% huh? No, dude, there was a 61% chance that I didn't get it. There's only one more left. Honestly, you were my favorite anyway. So you should totally come and be a part of what we're building over at the Beckbro Cookie Zoo. Yes, we convinced it. I think I have enough of the Ellie Buddies and also the Houndrons. So I do want to go see what the other realm has to offer. It looks like we'll be able to get onto the giant pirate ship over there. Knock, knock. Hello, I have come to bring you to my zoo. I know you're probably having like a good time out here in the wild, but trust me, in my zoo, people will look at you and I will feed you. It's a good deal, right? Wait, these ones are actually really cool looking. Okay, so they have like pirate outfits on. Oh, this one's a three star. Okay, we're going to grab that. Definitely. Okay. Capture you. Capture capture everything. Capture it. There is no time to think about anything else other than capturing these bad boys. All right, there we go. We're going to capture that. Capture you. Capture you over there. We're going to capture this part of the of the ruin. We're going to capture this. And uh, yes, let's go. And we also completed a quest. Unlock five realms. Wait, does that mean that we're able to morph into my pets now? No way. Let's go see. But before we do that, guys... $113,000 is sitting inside of my ATM. Let's try to hit 113,000 likes on today's video. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you guys could totally do that. Okay, we could actually add in some of our different things inside of here. Um, Looks like the L buddy is what has the highest rating. So we're gonna put all three of those inside of here. Oh, they're gonna love it. They fit so well in here. Okay, we have $152,000 to spend. So now we could buy a fan, a wind gust. Whoa, wait, that'll bring me up to an island and we can go up there and place even more things. Okay, we put down streets up here, a fence. Wait, we're gonna put down an enclosure up here. Hopefully I have enough money. We're just running around the outside, just adding everything. All right, just in case, let's add, oh, another $40,000 just went into my bank account. Adding in all of these brand new pets is the best thing I could have done. Okay, we're gonna add in some rocks, a little bit of terrain, a very tiny lake. That is more of a pond, but we're not gonna worry about it. We'll add in some pillars, uh, a little bit of grass, and some more pillars. Um, And now we can add in some clouds. Oh, whoa, that's crazy. And this is our first Aether enclosure. And now we've unlocked the new Aether realm, and it has this, a Prismus. It's a rainbow bird. I want myself a rainbow bird. Wait, do I have enough money to add in another Aether enclosure? closure. Let's go check it out. We'll add in some trees, a bench, oh, trees, a bench, some posts, a tree, and some beautiful clouds. And a different enclosure is a hundred thousand more dollars. Let's see. We can collect another quest, which should increase my overall star rating, right? There we go. Oh my gosh. Wait a second. We almost have enough. Look how fast our money is going up. We're getting like two or three thousand dollars every second. Yo, being a zookeeper pays well. I'm the, I think the only zookeeper and also the only zoo owner. Like, I don't think anybody else works here. Also, how did you guys get up here? Are you using, like, the wind gust device that I set up? I don't know. Hopefully nobody dies. This is kind of a little bit of, like, a hazard. All right, so let's go back to the hub and uh, we'll talk to Morpheus, the pet morpher, to see if... Wait, wait a second, we can morph into pets. But the only way to do it is if they're five stars. Okay, I might need to make a pet five stars. Hello, wise pet upgrader man. Should I upgrade my pets? His mustache said yes. Okay, so what do I have the most of that's four stars? I think it's the leafy. So if I select this, we combine this one with this one and this one. We did it. We can do it. We got a five star max level leafy. And now if I go back to Morpheus, we can talk to him and we can morph into it. Oh... <laughs> 
my god! I became the cutest thing ever! Look how shiny my butt is! This is awesome! Since we just made a new enclosure, we unlocked the higher cloud section where we can go find the rainbow birds! Hello, rainbow birds. Oh, yes. They have no idea it's me, and I'm gonna capture them. Really curious, too, if I morph into one of the pets in my zoo that can fly, will I be able to fly around? Because that would save me a ton of time. Did I not get that? What the? My chance was 88%. That means that there was a 12% chance that I did not get that. And I did not get that. That's kind of crazy. All right, this one's also level two. We're going to grab that. We're going to use our Nova Ruin this time, which is 100% chance. So as long as I draw this all very correct. Oh God, I messed up. Oh gosh. Okay. 98%. Okay, cool. We got it anyway. Let's go. There's some fancy ones over here. Oh, these ones look awesome. We definitely have to bring these ones back to my zoo. Whoa! Okay, we can get up here, and then we can put in our brand new birds. Then that bird, the fire bird, and then also the water ice bird. And now that means we have eight different pets in our zoo. We are collecting money at the cookie zoo now faster more than ever before. I think we should have enough to build the next enclosure, or at least parts of it. Gonna have to collect a little bit more money, add in some $52,000 rocks, and we need another $52,000 to upgrade even more. Leave a like and subscribe if you want to see a part two. I'll upgrade my zoo and find the rest of the pets.